So this is the revision case. We're going to be doing an extended rose incision, pre-auricular incision. I'm not going to be using this limb of the incision. And there is a 3.8 by 3.9 millimeter bony ankylotic mass, which is like this big, about four centimeters by four centimeters. You can see the outside projection of this, but inside it's like really big. So this is like just the tip of the iceberg, what you see. That's the first plan. The next is to harvest the temporoparietal and the facial flap, the temporalis muscle flap, and interposition it in between to form the pseudo or the new joint. Thereafter, I'm going to be working on this joint because her coronoids have grown longer. We're going to do a contralateral coronoid dotomy. That is, I'm going to cut that coronoid so that her mouth opening is going to be better on this side also. Because it's been 20 years, she doesn't open her mouth. So she's got 